Hey everybody, Daryl Narby here. Um, I'm just getting back and I just wanted to um, share something with you that sort of I've been thinking about. And it's about giving yourself permission. And what I mean about that is giving yourself permission to be happy. Now listen, we all have a story. We all have obstacles. We all have some tragedies. We all have things in our life that are not things to make us happy. Whether it's financial, whether it's physical, whether it's relationship, whether it's um, whatever it is. Whatever it is, we all have a story. And the way we get through things or the way we handle things is so important. Now, I'm not saying I'm giving... I want you to give yourself permission to be able to smile a little bit. We all have something to be thankful for. We all have some kind of blessing in our, in our life. The fact that you're watching this right now um, means that you have some blessings that other people may not have. Um, you have the ability to watch this on your phone or the computer or whatever. Um, and that's just one small little thing. But uh, and I'm not saying that you have to walk around with um, somebody, you know, like they sh shove sunshine stick up your butt, you know. I'm not talking about that stuff. I'm talking about just being able to find time to smile, to give yourself permission to say, it's okay if I smile. It's okay if I laugh a little. It's okay that even though this, this, and this is going on, that I find a minute to smile, maybe brighten somebody else's day. It's something that so many people don't do. I talk to a fair amount of people during the course of the week, whether it's, uh, it's mainly online, um, whether it's about the business stuff or my, my journey to health and my weight loss or whether it's um, about some of the groups that I'm an admin of. Um, a lot of times, the people talking to me are telling me the worst of what's going on in their life and I have to draw out the things that um, are a little bit happier for that person or maybe that person hasn't thought about, you know. Um, and it can be quite draining on you. Uh, and I'll be the first to admit, I left the, an admin uh, position of over, I think it was 100,000 members, because it sort of just started to suck the life out of me. Now this is going back a couple of years now, I have a smaller group uh, with chronic pain and fibromyalgia folks um, that I put together in honor of my friend Wendy who, who passed away. Uh, but the point is, is that we can express everything negative or we can start to share some of the positive things we have. We can start to appreciate. We can say to ourselves, it's okay to maybe try to make somebody laugh. I'm not going to focus only on this, this, and this. I'm going to focus on some of the good things. So I'll just keep that quick. It was just on my heart because I talked to so many people and I just want to let you know it's okay to give yourself permission to be happy. You don't have to run around with unicorns and butterflies flying out your ass. I'm just talking about it's okay for you to smile. It's okay for you to find a little joy, a little happiness. You deserve it. Whether you have faith or not, I can tell you God wants you to smile. He gave us these muscles right here for us to smile. So think about something. Think about a family member that gives you joy. Think about a memory of somebody that's passed. Instead of tears, think about it with a little bit of joy. Think about the wonderful opportunities, the beauty of nature, and so much more. Thank you so much for listening to me as always. Love you all, and bye-bye.